Thank you, Marcos. Sometimes it's hard to focus on the task at hand, but what is similar to reforms enhancing drugs in sports? There's a sort of academic enhancing drug. It turns out there is, and it's being called the study drug. It's easily found throughout college campuses, but information on its dangers aren't as readily available. Due to the legal risk, we are protecting the identity of the unprescribed user. During exam time, sometimes that sip of coffee is it enough. You can get it anywhere on campus, around finals, midterms. Adderall, a prescribed stimulant that is commonly used to treat ADHD, a condition where a patient has trouble focusing. Unprescribed, however, it's being used as a study drug. Try and pay attention to this needle. Pretty difficult considering everything that's going on around me, but with a dose of Adderall, it seems like that's the only thing you can focus on. A study done in 2013 showed that the term study associated with Adderall spiked during exam time on Twitter, indicating the frequency of Adderall being used as a study aid. Dr. Jonathan Lam understands the true benefits of the medication, but only when it's prescribed to a diagnosed patient. But if there are students out there that take other people's pill, um, there may be side effects that they don't know. Those side effects, according to Dr. Lam, include raised heart rate, raised blood pressure, weight loss due to loss of appetite, and insomnia. So they don't know, so they put themselves at risk. A reality that came too close to this unprescribed user, she lost feeling in her arm after taking Adderall and thought she was having a heart attack. Man, this is it. My parents are going to find out. My career is going to be over. And it's that moment where you start freaking out like, man, maybe this, this wasn't such a good idea, but then it goes away and you can breathe a little. Adderall can be dangerous, especially when combined with caffeine or alcohol. That's why Dr. Lam recommends for those interested in the medication to consult their physician. Also, we got an exclusive interview with an individual that sells Adderall. Hear his side of the story now on utanews.com.